What's up, Amore gang? What's up, Amore squad? It's your girl, Keela. And I'm back with another video, video, video. So today will be sort of like a Christmas special video. I will be putting up the Christmas tree with you guys. I know it's like December 12th or whatever, but... <coughs> excuse me, I always put my Christmas tree up late. So I'm going to do it with you guys. The lighting is terrible this way. So I'm probably going to put it this way. That way you guys can see me. This is the Christmas tree right here. It's still in the freaking box. These are all the decorations right there. Shout out to my grandmother because she got the tree for me. I told her to tell me what store to go in to get the Christmas tree. And next thing I know, I come home from work and she had got me a Christmas tree. So, shout out to grandma. If y'all hear my baby crying in the background, it's because he and his his playpen and he don't want to be. I had him out on the floor, but he kept picking up stuff and messing with the trash can and stuff and as y'all can see if y'all can see it my trash can is really really full their their dad took the kids to my oldest two to the doctor and he was in a rush so he forgot to take the trash out so time to put up this tree it's a small tree so it shouldn't take too long not really big and I don't know let me see she got me a tree topper Let's see if you can see it got me a tree topper she got me lights I want to do these lights blink so these ones don't look like they blink if she didn't give me a uh, blinking lights I'm probably just gonna go find some she got me some little garland to wrap around the tree got me two of them. I probably don't use both. She got me, she even got me ooh, the pins that she used to put the um the um decoration like the bulbs on. And she got me an extension cord. These are the bulbs right here. Now um she got me some candy canes but I forgot to go get them from her house. These are the bulbs right here. So we're just gonna do regular tradition colors. Traditional colors. So ooh. Something in my mind. Let's get to it. <clears throat> Sit down. Hi guys. I had to. My living room is really, really small. We're in the process of moving, and that's crazy because I'm putting the tree up. I was gonna wait to put the tree up until we fully move, but I was like, forget it. If we do move before Christmas, which I don't think we are, because I'm trying to wait till after Christmas. But um, if we don't move before Christmas, then that's cool. If we do, I'm just going to take it right back down. Or put it on the moving truck just like this. But I had to um, like rearrange my living room because it's really, really small. It's really small. Okay, so first you got to put the hooks on. So you just push them on like this. Stand the tree up. Yeah, but my living room is like super little, so I had to rearrange it a little bit and put my other couch in the dining room so it looks weird in there. But it is what it is. The living room in my new apartment is a lot bigger. It is huge. Sorry. All right, so I'm going to kind of scoot it out now. What I do like about this tree is the things... The branches automatically just fall into place. I do like that. They kind of just fall into place, which is weird. But it looks like I'm missing some down the bottom. It looks like I'm missing one. That's weird. Oh, I think it came off. Didn't I just see an extra one that came off? I guess not. Well, one is, oh, there it goes. It's crisscross. Yeah, this tree is Pretty, pretty weird looking. So, there is a lot of space missing on this tree. Um, Grandma, what in the world kind of tree is this? I mean, it's really, I guess I gotta spread the tree, the branches out and then like, um, cover it up with because this tree is nothing like my tree from last year like the branches are really spread apart and it looks weird once i once i spread it apart i'm going to show y'all how it looks so spread the tree out 
and it looks a lot better because at first it was just like really look crappy looking so once i put the decorations on it it'll look a lot better <clears throat> okay so i guess i'll start with the light The light seemed to take the longest because you gotta keep wrapping and wrapping and wrapping. I'm gonna try to do it delicately so I don't any of the lights. But this is a lot of lights within itself. These are a whole bunch of lights. Let me plug up the extension cord. Voila! I'm gonna plug up the extension cord. These rubber bands are so tight on my wrist, it's making a print. I'm too fat. Look, it made a print on my wrist. <laughs> this extension cord, you can tell it's brand new. This is pretty white. It's just as white as my shirt. It blend right in with my shirt. You can't even see it. <laughs> this lighting is the bomb. All right, so let's plug up the Christmas tree lights. I mean, let's plug up the extension cord. And then we'll get to the lights. What I'm going to do is plug up all of the lights to each other. I'm probably going to start at the top and work my way down. Might be smarter that way, huh? I'm going to have to plug these lights. Well... I guess I'll start at the bottom and work my way up because I have to plug these lights up. Let me just see if they all work. Okay, as of right now, they look like they all work. In a freaking hotel. Yes, we did. And I was pregnant with Messiah. Now he's eight months. So this will be his first Christmas. And he is going to enjoy it. My kids have so much stuff, it's not even funny. Like, I want to do a video of me wrapping their gifts, but I know by the time I start wrapping their gifts, they're probably going to be home from the doctor. They know most of the gifts that they have anyways, but I still don't want them to see it because they're going to act like they want to play with their gifts and think that they can. And I don't want to be mean to them and tell them no. Therefore, I'm probably just going to do a video of me wrapping their gifts while they're in school to make it easier on me. All right, so that was the first set of lights. Hopefully this second box spreads all the way around the rest of the tree or I'm just gonna spread it out even more. I'm gonna spread them out even more as much as possible because I put them kind of close, but it does get smaller at the top, so. What did I do with the end piece? There it goes. Oh wait, wrong way. Wait a second. So how am I supposed to connect these? How am I supposed to connect these? If that piece goes there, then how do these connect? Oh, here it goes. Ooh, I'm slow. I thought I, <laughs> I didn't see the piece at first. I'm like, where's the other piece? Okay. Here we go. All right. So it should be long enough to go around the remainder of the tree, probably even longer. Probably be some access left over because these are a lot of lights. <clears throat> My kids are going to be so excited when they get home and see that the tree is up. I wanted them to help me. I really did to help me put the tree up like we do it as a family, but it didn't work out that way because they definitely had, couldn't miss that doctor's appointment. But they are they are excited about the tree being up in general, even if they don't even if they didn't help me, they just want the tree up. So either way, my babies are going to be excited. jumble of lights right here. It's the way that they are put together like Jesus Christ. 
They so stuck together, it don't make no sense. They gonna have to make this part work. Because I'm running out of space. It's, if you guys can see it, because it's like really jumbled around this part. Why I look so jumbled, but I'm stretching them out now so it can look, so it can spread out further. Because they are really So the lights are on, uh, as you guys can see. Um, gonna do the bulbs next because I'm gonna do the bulbs before I do the um, the garland. Oh, I'm so excited for Christmas, guys! Oh, the tree, the, uh, the tree topper lights up too. I forgot about that part. But the tree topper has a light too. Now, how I light it up is the question. Well, how I plug it up is the question. Because I don't think it's a plug. There. Oh, you don't need a plug. So how does it stay on? It says try me oh so this is the light but you have to put batteries in it so i'm going to get some batteries right quick all right so we're going to get batteries my battery look, my battery on my phone is low too my baby's sleep all right so getting the batteries And I'm getting my charger. And let's go put the light, the battery in the lights. And the tree topper light. And I'm going to pull up my phone up too because my battery is going dead. The hard part about this is keeping my phone standing up with the charger in it because if you have an iphone you know how it is it doesn't stand up right with the charger in it all right let's put the batteries in this glitter is like getting all over me Okay, and this is the light to the tree topper, see? And I'm just gonna stick it up here. I'm gonna use a piece of the, like a couple pieces of the top of the tree and just kind of sit it up there so where it doesn't fall and it's balanced. And I'm gonna try to hide the battery pack. I'm gonna fold it. I'm gonna fold the branches around it so that way it doesn't look all ratchet. If it falls, oh well. It shouldn't though. Hopefully it doesn't. right there so it don't slide out hopefully it don't slide out but that's the top it's gonna take me a minute to do these so i'm not gonna 
not going to record the entire thing. I'll probably just come back and show you guys once it's finished. I just want to do a couple of them, though. Just to get it started. Just to get it started. So many. So many pins. She gave me all, she gave me all colors. She gave me green, silver, gold. And this is how it looks. You just put it in, hook it like that, hook it to the tree. The silver pins, of course, are longer. They hang longer, so I'm gonna use some of them too. To dangle, especially at the bottom, so they can dangle from the tree. Okay guys, so this is my tree. Pretty much all the bulbs are up there. <clears throat> um, I'm gonna cut the light on to the topper. Once I find the click of the switch. Okay, there we go. Now it's on. I just gotta wrap the garland around it and I also didn't, um, I don't, I don't have the candy canes yet either. They're still at my grandma's house. <clears throat> if that makes sense. And I don't want to cover up too much of the lights either. So if one looks right, then that's all I'm going to use. But if it doesn't, <clears throat> then I'll probably, oh yeah, this is short. So, uh, this is how it looks so far. Does it look right with that garland up there? I guess so. So I'll use both of them. At first I didn't want to use both, but I guess I might as well. I just don't want it to look like too much. But I guess they say go big or go home. So I might as well. Try to do like a loop de loop. This part right here, you won't even be able to see. Oh yeah, it does look cute. I like it. Y'all, when I say I knocked the whole tree over, oh my God, I just had to do some got they gonna surgery to my tree. I don't even know if it's gonna stand up. If the kids knock it over, that's it. They gonna have to be real careful. Cause baby, when I tell y'all, I knocked this whole tree over. I broke the whole leg on the tree. and knocked the whole fucking tree over and broke a piece to the tree. Yo, 
I ain't even gonna look for the piece to this one. I'm weak, y'all. If y'all could have seen that blooper, I'm gonna put the blooper at the end of the video just because it was so funny. But I did not mean to not to break the leg on the tree. I was trying to scoot it back, but I forgot this tree. This tree was, um, it didn't cost much. So, yeah, y'all know how that goes. I don't even want to tell my grandma because she gonna joke me. She gonna be like, "How in the world did you do that?" I don't know, grandma. I don't know trying to hurry up and get the tree up. Now I done broke the tree. Trying to be a fast ass, excuse my language. I done broke the damn tree. Now you can kind of tell that the tree is leaning. I'm gonna show y'all. <laughs> can y'all tell it's leaning? <laughs> I'm about to put the skirt up then. Here's the tree skirt. And tonight when I get off, I'm gonna wrap some, I'm gonna wrap some gifts. See how rough I am, y'all? Now y'all see what I'm talking about. I'm so rough. I'm so heavy handed, it don't make no sense. That's how I be putting marks on myself. And I, I like this Christmas skirt, Christmas tree skirt because it has, you can attach it. The other one I had, you couldn't attach it. It was just, that's how it was. However it came, that's how it was. You couldn't connect it. This one you can connect. So I do like that. It's pretty big. But once I put the gifts under here, it won't look so big. I'm not going to connect it because it's so big. I'm just going to leave it like this. Okay. This is how the Christmas tree looks before the gifts go under it. Pretty cute, huh? All right. So thanks, you guys, for watching this video. Um, like, comment, subscribe, share. Stay tuned for more videos. Y'all comment down below what videos do you want to see from me and Keith. And I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Peace. My own. Oh, fuck. Shoot. <laughs> I knocked the whole tree over.